Today we will see how we can convert a PDF file to a Word document, edit the Word document and convert it back to PDF files because that is required for submitting your assignments in Brightspaces. So this is how we can do it. You will need Microsoft Office 2013, 2016 or 2019. If you are a student in Ontario, you can get a free copy of Microsoft Office 2016 and this is what you have to do. Go to microsoft.com for educators. This is the website. You can actually search it and you can find that. In the title area, you can see education, school leaders, educators, IT professionals, students, higher education, etc. So if you're a teacher or a student, you can get a free copy. In order to do that, you can identify the login for the student or the teacher. So if you actually come to the bottom of this page, you can see you can log in by entering your school email address here. And the password is the same as the password that you use to log in to your school account. So use your school email address and your password, log into Microsoft Office 365, download the Microsoft Office 365, install in your computer before you could start, converting your PDF files to Word and then back to PDF files. So in order to actually see how it works, we will first open Microsoft Office or Microsoft Word. So this is the document that I want to convert. So I'm just going to show you how to do it by starting from the beginning. I'm going to open a document. So I am going to identify a document on my desktop. It's easy to locate it once I'm done the conversion. So I have placed a file in this folder, converted files. I'm going to open this PDF file which says Atomic Theory Assignment Original. I'm going to open it. It's going to take a few uh, seconds to actually open the document. The conversion process is happening right now. Okay. The conversion is complete. It's opening. I have to enable editing. That's because the document is already open. So Word will now convert your PDF to an editable Word document. That's what we want. Okay. Okay. So now we have converted the document. This is what you have. So if you look at the file name, Atomic Theory Assignment Original, that was the document I started with. So if you go here, you can see Atomic Theory Assignment Original. This was a PDF file. Now we have converted it and it's a Word document. Okay. So the next thing you have to do is you have to save this file. So we're going to save as a Word document. Okay. So we are saving it on desktop in the converted files folder. I'm going to save it. Here there is an extension, the earlier extension, I'm going to delete that one. So it will now save it as a docx file, save. So now Atomic Theory Assignment Original. So this is a Word document from the original document, okay? So now we're going to work on this original document. We're going to make some changes in Microsoft Office. So I'm going to type in the answer to this question. I'm going to insert a formula. This is how you can insert a formula. Go to insert equations. F is equals to the frequency is equals to. I have a fraction. Is C over lambda. And I need to insert a symbol. So I go to insert again. Go to symbols. And the first choice here is lambda. But you can also see more symbols over here. I'm going to select lambda. That's what I need. And I'm done. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to change the color of this text that I just entered so that I can identify it later. So this is the text that I added to a PDF file after converting it into Microsoft Word. Now the next step is save it and now save it again as a PDF file. So you have two couple of options. One you can go to save as or you can go to export. If you go to export, create PDF document, or if you go to save as, you can go down under the name of the file, you can scroll down until you see PDF file. 
select that and I'm going to write change the file name to converted file converted back to PDF that's what I did here and I'm going to save it okay and this is a file that I just saved and it's a PDF file you can see the file name here see the text in red color and now I cannot do any I can't edit it here anymore because now it's a PDF file so this is how you can actually open a PDF file convert it to Word type in your answers for the assignments save it convert it back to a PDF file and upload it in Brightspace because uh, once you convert it to PDF the formatting is not lost and for that reason I would always uh, suggest that you submit your assignments as a PDF file so that's how you can convert a PDF to a Word document